Yes, yes. Hello, guys. Uh, welcome back again to No Max TV, and uh, welcome to this tutorial. Uh, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you uh, how you can make uh, and receive uh, phone calls on your computer. So you may need to receive uh, phone calls or make a phone calls on your computer. Uh, maybe when you are busy at work, when you are using your computer, and when you want that, uh, you want so that it can be easier for you to make and receive a call when you are using uh, your computer. So this is the way I'm going to show you. Uh, make sure you subscribe to uh, Normac TV and the button below. Uh, like this video. Share this video to your friends and turn the notification bell button so as you always get notified when we upload new video here at no max tv if you have any comment or any suggestion or a question leave it in the comment section so without wasting time let's get started so i'm going to open my computer so now you see this uh, that is uh, an application which is called phone link and this phone link is the one which is going to help you uh, to to ring your phone and also to be able to make a call on your computer so if it is there what you have to do now uh, you have uh, to go back first and you check on our settings then you make sure that you have your microsoft office account which is signed in your computer so now or you see this now come here and click here and see this is microsoft account when you click on this account you are going to see the account here uh, here which is uh, means that you see I have account on this option uh, which means I'm signed in my, my computer so uh, if you, have, you are not signed in so you need to first sign in or if you don't have a Microsoft Office account you need to first create it and sign into Microsoft Office account once you are signed in so now you go uh, you go there and search phone as we have been searching you see phone link now you open this phone link so after opening this phone link also you wait you can see you have uh, various uh, options here uh, you are uh, uh, getting uh, given an option to choose whether you are going to ring with android phone whether you are going to use with uh, an iphone or any other type of phone that you may be uh, wanting to ring to so that you will be able to make conversations or to make call even receive call on your computer so after doing this so, so you can get the phone notifications you can get more information here so i can click here uh, get started use your android phone so as you can see uh, they are saying that on your android phone go to www.aka.ms that is your pc so for surface view and select some software link to windows is already installed we open from the link so you can access here now i'm going to go to my android phone now and i continue downloading the, the app first so now uh, after getting to my android phone so i have to go to play store then search for the application uh, which is here as you can see i search for the application called phone link or link to pc yes i type phone link or link to windows so when i type phone link also you can see uh, there is application which is coming which is called the microsoft in compilations and we have you can see that it has uh, 500 million plus which downloaded this uh, application so now i have to hit install this one so i have to wait this so that it can get finished installing on my android phone so uh, now once it is installed so i have to follow uh, other options so that i can be able to use it on my computer so i have to wait some minutes it can take some uh, seconds to get installed and you can see now so it is already now installed after uh, verifying it so now uh, what you have to do now you see now it is uh, installed here in my phone So you see now it is installed on my phone uh, what i have to do i have to go back and open this uh, application on my android phone so you see now once i open this uh, application 
in my Android phone. It is going to be uh, bringing a notion. Here you can see it is saying that I have. Uh, yes, you see now uh, here there is a notion which is saying that I can link uh, my uh, my uh, link your phone and PC. So here, when I click here, also I'm going to scan QR code. You can see, they say that link with QR code. You can say, I, I can choose to link with QR code. Yes, when I click here, continue. So they are bringing an option to scan QR code. Then I allow this QR code to scan. So what I have to do, I have to go back to my computer and allow QR code to be displaying so that I can start scanning that QR code. So on my computer, as I have to scan the QR code, so I have to choose here. Then I can choose to, I have the QR or the ring. So when I choose, I have the ring to Windows app ready. So I have to pair here, pair with QR code. When I choose pair with QR code, so you see, try again. You see now uh, they are bringing an option to scan QR code. So now I have to wait and uh, go back so to my Android phone and scan QR code. So you see now here this is a QR code. I have to scan it with my Android phone. As you have seen, they gave me a notion to scan also uh, QR code. So what I have to do, I have to use my phone and scan that QR code. So now. Uh, let me scan this QR code and you see what uh, the result of this. Yes, continue. Uh -huh, scan it. So pairing now. You can see a notion here which is uh, showing that is pairing. So, and you have to wait this option to pair when done also you can see here now i have to click done this so on my phone also they bring an option here you can see now on my computer they say that you, you just need to allow the permissions on your phone also what you have to do you have to go to your android phone and allow all the permissions on your android phone so let me allow all the permissions on my android phone so as you see now on my android phone they brought an option to allow the permissions so i have to hit this continue to allow the permission so now i hit allow so ring to windows to make and manage phone calls yes i hit allow so ring to windows to access photos media so allow allow so all text messages then continue yes let's stay connected yes allow then hit done as you see now i allowed all the options here and i hit have to hit allow Yes, you see now your phone and PC are linked here and I have to go to my computer and you can see on my computer. As you can see on my computer, you see now they are saying that you are all set. Your device is now connected with the phone link. So now I can choose to continue. When I choose to continue, I can start also getting all the options. As you can see now, I put get started. Once I put get started, I can view my photos, I can make calls, I can send text messages. Now here I can also make a call. So now I leave your phone in my pocket. So maybe I can leave my phone in my pocket or so I can speak. Skip this one. So you see now, uh, here, now I can open settings on my phone. You see now I can also get it, uh, click here, get it started. So where they are requesting me to get connected on my phone. As you can see now, I have phone here and I, I can put phone number here and make a call. So I can call someone here. Yes, I can type any phone number I want to call here. 
Yes. So now I can also hit a uh, call someone. You can see now my phone here is calling that person I want to call here. As you can see. Now see now boot off. You have to make sure that your boot off is turned on so that you can make call away and you have to make sure that you have internet connection. Uh, as far as everything is okay, you can make a call, you can receive a call from someone. Also in simple and easy steps. You can see here there is a boot off. There is microphone, there is music, there is also battery. There is a phone name here. You can see my phone name. There's, you can see the messages here. You can read them. So this is how you can connect your PC and your Android phone in easy and simple steps. You can make calls and receive calls on your Android phone in easy and simple steps. So subscribe to this channel, like this video, and share this video to your friends. And if you have any question or suggestion, leave it in the comment section. Don't forget to, to turn on the notification bell button so as you always get notified when we upload a new video here at you know Max TV. Thank you. We love you so much.